Um, from the beginning, when I played in the national team, I was 20 years. Uh, we didn't have a lot of strength at all. It was like mostly body weight, like 15 minutes. And uh, it was, they didn't talk so much or did a lot of strength back in that time. But after my ACL injury, when I was, when I was 27, I met uh, people who taught me what you can do and I experienced that uh, we called us uh, elite uh, football players and uh, I thought that we were not properly trained so um, while I was doing my rehab I realized that uh, we need to do more with that uh, strength condi conditioning practice overall. So, so today is very, very different. First of all, I think they, get, they got this experience well, when they're starting to do more strength training. Uh, they feel uh, just in a couple of months, very big difference on the field when they feel stronger. And uh, of course, that also starting to get to know yourself, your body, and that because your body is your tool when you're playing, and it's uh, you have to uh, take care of it as good as possible to perform. Thomas, as a coach, is very experienced. He have uh, been coached for lots of teams in Sweden and uh, then the national team for different countries. Um, and of course, he's been playing in a high, high level also. Um, his strength is uh, that he's uh, very down to earth and very humble. And uh, he tries to meet the players in that level so they can understand. Um, I was young back then, uh, so it, uh, the first team I played under him, it was, uh, I was like 20, so uh, then back then I don't remember so much. But uh, the second team uh, I played with uh, when he was a coach, um, he, uh, what he did was to get the team together and uh, we didn't have these uh, top players in Sweden and everyone thought that we will just fail this team and uh, he made us to come together and really perform as a team and because of that we won the league two years in a row. So I've been here for two and a half months and uh, where I can see how the girls improved on the field is uh, the passing game. Uh, the, he, he's been working a lot with uh, drills and make, try to make the girls understand the importance of accuracy in the passes and uh, we have to play hard balls and everything like that. So he's been very patient and like doing it over and over and over again and uh, actually for like last week it was like everything just came to place and uh, the last week's practice was really really good and there were we could have a, a high intensity in the in the practice and uh, it was really nice to see yeah thomas called me in the beginning of this year and asked if I wanted to go to India and work with him and that came as a shock because I never thought that I didn't even, even ever <laughs> have that in my mind to go to another country and do this job. Uh, I do yoga, um, I've been here for Ayurvedic treatments <laughs> and uh, I love the food, as you know, and 
Dongsa is my one of my favorites. So when he asked, so it, it was not so difficult for me to to say yes to this job because I've been to India a couple of times before and I love the country and uh, to work in this environment and uh, with the national place like this and just be able to focus on uh, football and uh, strength tra training. It was like, it couldn't be better. <laughs> <laughs>